Hey friends, it's Becca with Beautiful Mess Plans. Um, today we're going to do a flip through of February. Um, it is the last day of February, it's 28th, but I figure that's fine. There's nothing, you know, that we're going to miss out on. So here's how the month turned out. If you'll remember, I didn't start out the month in the Hobonichi Cousin. I actually started out the month in my B6. Um, I'm not going to show you that because I really didn't make it very far in it. Um, and you're really just missing like the first couple, you know, the first, what, six days. Um, but this is what the month looks like. Um, just kind of getting my feet wet, trying to figure out how I'd wanted to handle it. Um, and then obviously, like I said, I guess it's the first five days that was actually in my B6, but there's not really much. I guess I have it right here. I can show you how the daily pages turned out. Um, it was a lot of the same. And this is when I kind of discovered that I just had more room than I needed. I didn't need the amount of space that I had. And as I had set this up and then I realized I don't want to continue doing it this way. So that's when I did a trial of this and I loved it and I thought it worked out so well. And it, you know, you'll see, I'll show you actually my daily pages, my journaling pages with stuff covered up, um, that it's nice to have everything together. So and this was a, a good amount of room. I could put my any kind of schedule stuff down. So I had my work stuff during my working hours and then any to-do stuff. And I still had room for, you know, not day-specific stuff or just whatever I thought of. And I did do a little bit of memory keeping here and there um, this first week. Um, and then here's the second week. I did a little bit more because these two days, um, my kids left this day to go to my parents' house until Saturday. So it was really my husband and I, and I just kind of write down some, wrote down some of the stuff that we did, a um, little bit of memory keeping, and then you could tell my kids came back because I just didn't do that. Um, and I'll kind of probably do a mix from, sorry if you can hear that in the background, my daughter is eating M&Ms. Um, I'll do a mix probably from here on out um, of, you know, some memory keeping after the fact. Um I don't remember what I was saying because I had to stop, but this is um, that week. And then this was last week. A lot of the same. I didn't really do as much memory keeping. I did write down like when I finished books, but other than that, it was pretty, it was actually a really busy week. Um, so that was last week. And then this is the current week, which you would have just saw the plan with me. So these are the um, two days. This is where we're at right now. Um, I did, again, do some memory keeping of when I finished a book. I mean, that was pretty simple. So we're going to flip to my journaling pages. So I decided to just decorate, um, like, the first page. Um, I'm not going to go. I didn't cover up whatever I have in January, so I'm not going to go back there. But I'll show you all of this. So I did a combination of pictures. I used my decor stuff. And I did cover up anything that... Hopefully I got everything <laughs> uh, that I really know I don't want to be read. Um, I use alphas. You know, I try to keep it pretty simple. Um, I am a longhand journaler. I memory keep other ways. I do like to add pictures, but for the most part, I just journal. And some days it's more than other days. It just kind of depends on the day. So like this day, it was a full day. This day was a full day. Um, but then I had, you know, days that this stopped like up here somewhere, you know, so it's kind of a, it's definitely a mixed bag when it comes to journaling, depending on how I'm feeling, what happened that day. You know, I do a combination of talking about the day, talking about whatever's on my mind. I don't just talk about the day. Oftentimes I talk about whatever is on my brain. So sometimes I literally talk about books because that's what's on my head, on my brain. So, uh, this is when my kids were gone. So I added the quote. These two stickers were actually from the Deadbolt Mystery Society boxes that my husband and I did those days while my kids were gone. Um, a picture of us. We went for a walk. Um, and a, yeah, so it's a lot of the same. Just kind of decorate however I feel like it. There's really no rhyme or reason for why I decorate a certain way. So this was my... We celebrated my son's birthday with my parents this day. Um, and then his birthday was actually yesterday, which I guess when you're seeing this, it'll have been a few days ago, but so I added some photos and then we have today, I, I kind of journal throughout the day. So that's why there's not very much here yet. So, um, yeah, that's what I have. I, um, 
I've really, really enjoyed this a lot. I enjoyed having everything here together and just having like the one book to carry around my house. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this flip through and um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.